The Liberty School District taking a stand against what it calls aggressive open enrollment practices of students going to Girard City Schools. 27 First News reporter Nadine Grimley spoke with superintendents of both districts today and joins us live with their reaction in the studio tonight. Well, Dave and Mandy, district officials in Liberty say statistically speaking, the students leaving their district and going to Girard is creating a racial imbalance in Liberty. If we continue to allow this, then in essence, we would be in support of segregation. So we're taking a stand. Liberty Superintendent Joseph Nora says each year the district loses about 250 kids to open enrollment, 100 of which attend Girard. We believe at this point when upwards to over 90% of those students, okay, are non-minority students, that we believe at this point that it's creating a racial imbalance in our school district. It's this reason in a revenue loss of about $610,000 each year because of the large number of Liberty Natives enrolling in Girard that the Board of Education is taking action, passing a resolution stating that the district, quote, will no longer grant open enrollment consent for Native Caucasian students to the Girard City School District. For um, the school up north that wants to, uh, you know, present a case as to this, it's just mind-boggling mind right now. Girard Superintendent David Capazello says what their district has to offer when it comes to classes and extracurriculars is why students want to enroll there. You're losing 250 students from a district. You know, he's claiming we take 100. Where's the other 150 going? And then why are you losing 250 kids a year and what are you doing about it? Well, Liberty School Board isn't saying never. Members said in the resolution passed last night that they will reconsider when, quote, racial balance becomes proportional. Live in the studio tonight, Nadine Grumley, WKBN 27 First News.